Most of you are not doing what you want to do with your life because you're worried about somebody else's opinion. Normally you're fucked up mom <laughs> or you know, your spouse or you know, somebody very close to you is fucking your shit up. Right? So that's awesome for me. But on the flip side, in the macro of me not giving a shit, when somebody leaves one comment on an Instagram post of like, this guy's a scam artist, I'm like strategizing how to fix that like it's the most important thing that has ever happened to me. Pulling from opposite directions is like a bridge, my friends. It is not something that you should be scared of. Way many too many people think it's a contradiction, think it's a flaw. When you define what true intelligence is, it is holding opposite things in your head and allowing them to push. I love that everything is easy to me. We were having fun beforehand. I'm like, what's this thing I'm doing after my keynote? And they're laughing. They're like, you didn't read it? I'm like, I haven't read shit in 20 years. (laughs) I don't need to be prepared. I stay in my lane. The reason I love doing Q&A is if I don't know the answer to your question, I'll say, I don't know the answer to your question. We are fronting. We are fronting in our society. You need to triple down, quadruple down on who you are and what you know, and then you can win. When people ask me, how do I produce content? One big breakthrough in my community was when about six months ago I said, you know what? You should document instead of create. It opened up so much for so many when they realized, wait a minute, right. You need to be documenting in your stories or in your vlog about the journey of becoming an entrepreneur not claiming that you're a 21 year old life coach and pay me $5,000 a month and I'll teach you how to fucking live. Fuck you.